Hi guys. Hi guys, welcome to Hilltip. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, this is really something. Yeah. Chelsea, when doing a job quickly and efficiently, the right equipment is essential. Yeah, I agree. A pickup truck with a snowplow and a salt spreader is an excellent choice for any company that wants to give the best service possible to their clients. Why use a pickup truck to fight against snow and ice? versatility. Using a pickup with a snowplow and a spreader can easily manage a variety of different work sites, including parking areas, driveways, bike paths and roads and so on. Uh, I guess it's pretty quick and easy to handle. Yes, a pickup allows you to move quickly from work site to work site versus slower moving vehicles like tractors and wheel loaders. And Hilti plows are easy to mount and dismount, allowing the vehicle to be used all year around for any other jobs. Well, let's take a closer look. This looks pretty cool. You have two different kinds of snow plows here, right? Yes, you can choose the right snow plow depending on your work site. Oh, cool. Yeah. And what are the advantages of this plow? Yes, I can show you. Yeah. Oh, wow. It's totally like Oh, wow. <laughs> Crazy. So this V-shape allows you to scoop, stack, and move more snow than a straight blade. Wow, that's pretty cool. Yeah, and this saves time and increases productivity, especially on parking lots. Nice. Sounds fast and efficient. Yeah, sure is. What is important to think of when installing a snowplow on a European pickup truck? Well, European pickups are not as heavy as the American pickups. So you should really just install a snowplow that has been designed for a European pickup truck size. Okay, that makes sense. Hilti specially designed construction allows for a very durable and lightweight snowplow that doesn't overload the front axle of the European pickup trucks. Oh, cool. Look at this lightweight structural frame that oh, wow. is integrated in this box construction, ready with the trip spring brackets and cutouts for lightweight structure. Cool. Yeah. Wow, so this is just gonna go like here? Yeah, inside the frame. Oh, nice, nice. So Frank, why do we need trip springs? I can show you. Let's have a look at the straight bed with the optional orange color. Oh yeah, I, I really like this color. Yeah, so uh, in addition to the hydraulic shock valves, the trip springs works as the safety system for the snowplow. And that's important to always think about safety for the snowplow and the vehicle. Exactly. The cutting edge is in two pieces and it trips over the obstacle and it still does its job Wow, but I mean, how amazing that this can still do its job even if it hits something. Yeah. I, I mean, what a lifesaver. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. Another thing that makes the hilltip snowplows unique is the tracking system. You can see how many kilometers or miles your plow has been up or down on the route with evidence of where you have been plowing. Wow, but that's very cool. Yes, it is. You mentioned earlier, Frank, that it's really easy to remove the snowplow. Can you demonstrate? Yeah, sure. At first, we unplug the all-in-one electrical connector for the power supply, the controller, and the heated LED lights. Okay. And then you, Chelsea, you can 
put down the plow stands. There you go. And now you're ready to just drive the pickup away. It's that easy? Exactly. Wow, okay, let's just drive away then. Yeah. Perfect. Frank, how long have you been making spreaders here at Hilltip for? This is the 10th anniversary of the first Hilltip spreader produced. Wow, congratulations. Oh, thank you. Back then, my brother Tom and I decided to develop advanced technology that the industry deserved. And that's what we did at Hilltip with our team. Amazing. So here we have an all-in-one combi spreader. Can you tell us, Frank, all we need to know? Yeah, sure. This is a iStriker 550 that has capacity of 600 liter solid material and 330 liter liquid. Wow. Yeah, and it's an all-in-one combi spreader that can do all the three uh, the icing method, spreading, pre-wetting, and liquid spraying. Spread pre-wet material to save 30%, or spray brine to save 70% of salt usage. And it's all in one machine. Oh, but that's such a smart standard you use here at Hilltip. Yeah, and this is our development philosophy, and always been, that a customer should always be able to buy a standard pickup and install our equipment without any modification. I've seen this before. Is it Hilltip's two-way GPRS tracking and control system? Yes, it is. Yeah. And still 10 years after our launch, it's one of a kind in the industry in this segment. And every year, we take steps to the next level. Always thinking of the future. Yeah, so you should stay tuned. Oh, this one is so cute. Do you have different sizes of these? Yes, we do. We offer these in three different sizes. 120, 200 liter, and 300 liter. Wow. 4.5, 7.5, and 10 cubic feet. But this one's my favorite. Oh it's, yeah? It's a small one. So, <laughs> <laughs> these machines uh, have a horizontal stainless steel auger. They're dual control, independently controlled motors, and multiple mounting options for tractors, V-loaders, and pickups. It's always good to have options, but I like this smaller one. Yeah, all hilltip spreaders are very easy to install. Just look at this one here. With the handle, you can just grab it, lift it onto the tailgate or the tow hitch. And you're ready to go. Exactly. Perfect. Very easy. Frank just told me that even this small spreader can be controlled by a smartphone, right? Yes, and it has the two-way GPRS control system and tracking all included with this small machine as well. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's it from us, guys. Any last words, Frank? Yeah, I hope that you all have found this discussion with Chelsea very informative and that you learn something what is important to think of when you invest on your next plow or spreader. Thanks guys for watching and we'll see you in the next episode. Bye. Bye.